everybody. Hopefully you guys are here with me on this good Friday morning. If you're not here this morning, that's okay. You can come back and watch this video at a later time. But I wanted to get out here today and wish everybody a happy Easter, a happy Good Friday, and on Monday. I hope you guys enjoy your little spring break that we have today. So if you're on here, I don't want you guys to work too hard today because today's really a day off for you guys. So I hope you guys have a beautiful Easter day. It's a little cold this morning. I've been out working in my yard this morning. That's why I have my hat on. Make sure I don't want to get my head sunburned. But there's a man here that passed away a couple days ago. His name is Bill Withers. And he had this song. It's called Lean On Me. I actually sang this song around Christmas time at Lovejoy. But I had my piano. And Miss Holder, she uses the office room because she's working from home right now. So I can't be in the office with my piano, but I'll try and play it on my ukulele today. We'll see how it goes. I hope you enjoy the song. It goes like this. Sometimes in our lives, we all have pain. We all have sorrow. But if we are wise, we know that there's always tomorrow. Lean on me when you're not strong, and I'll be your friend. I'll help you carry on, for it won't be long till I'm going to need somebody to lean on. Please swallow your pride if you have things you need to buy. I'm sorry that he passed away. This is a great song because everybody needs somebody to lean on sometimes. Somebody, everybody needs help. So I'm glad that if you have somebody that you can lean on, you can lean on Mr. Holder here and Mrs. Holder. You can lean on your parents and your grandma and grandpa. And hopefully you have somebody that you can lean on too. All right. I'll just use my ukulele here today. You know what I want to do? Actually, I can't do that today. I'm actually doing a lot of work out in my yard. But you guys, hopefully, you can take a break from your online learning day and you can do a little bit of this. some dollar bills in there. Well, hopefully it's not just a jelly. Hopefully if you have an Easter egg hunt, there'll be a quarter or maybe even something else. I hate it on Easter egg hunts when they put those snicker bars and stuff because they all get melted inside after the Easter egg hunt's done. So I'd rather find money in there. But that's just the way I All right. Down by the bay Where those water melons grow Well, I dare not go, or if I do, my mother will say, have you ever seen a bear just combing on his head, down by the bay, down by the bay, 
where those watermelons grow. Back to my home. Well, I dare not go. For if I do, my mother will say, You better find the agency. You better find those agencies. Back to my home. Well, I dare not go. For if I do, my mother will say, You know what mama say, don't you? I love you. Sorry, on Wednesday, I actually went to my mom's house to get something and to help her with something because you can never get too old to help mom. I'm 33, getting ready to be 34 years old, but you can always help mom, and no matter what, you can always have time for your mom and your dad and your grandma and your grandpa as long as they're here. So I made sure to help her when I could. That's why we didn't have music on Wednesday, but we're back today. Good to see all of you. I've had a lot of requests for this song here lately. I know it's a great catchy one. I'll do it again since it's Friday and you guys can sing along. I posted that cartoon on a Friday. That cartoon's pretty funny. Uh, it's definitely, definitely, definitely Canadian, if you know what I mean. Canadian type of humor, but it's very, very funny. So hopefully you'll take the time to watch that, but we'll sing The Cat Came Back today. You ready? Now, old Mr. Johnson had a problem of his own. He had a yellow cat that wouldn't leave his home. Well, he tried and tried to give the cat away, but the cat came back the very next day. But the cat came back the very next day. The cat came back. He thought he was a cutter, but the cat came back. He just wanted to stay sing that part of the song, you gotta sing that today, okay? The cat came back. I'm not gonna sing it the next time. I'm gonna use my low voice now for this next part. Right? Here we go. They gave the little cat to a man in a balloon, and he took him all the way to the man in the moon. The balloon came down about 90 miles away. What happened to the man? Well, I dare not say. I could hear you all the way over here. It sounded awesome today. Since it is Easter, I gotta sing some songs about bunnies. And now you might recognize this next song is Yankee Doodle went to town riding on his pony. Stuck a feather in his hat and he called it macaroni. But I'm gonna change the words to it about an Easter bunny. It goes like this. Easter Bunny hops along, the Easter's here again. He's painted a ball, or he's painted many colored eggs to give him to his friends. Easter Bunny hops along, he hides his colored eggs. Easter Bunny hops along, it's Easter time again. I'm gonna do this my turn, your turn, so we can learn this little song. I'll sing first. Easter Bunny hops along Easter's here again He's painted many colored eggs To give to all his friends Easter Bunny hop along he hides his colored eggs. Easter Bunny 
you hop along. It's Easter time again. All right, nice. We'll try and sing it together this time. I see where Emily says hi. Good morning, Emily. I see where Mrs. Gross over at West is watching. Mrs. Gorsuch, good to see all of you guys. Let me scroll down and see if I got any more friends saying hello. Oh, well, that's it. All right, here we go. Let's sing this Easter song. Easter Bunny, hop along. Easter's here again. He's painted all the holidays to give to all his friends. Easter Bunny hop along, he hides his colored eggs. Easter Bunny hops along, it's Easter time again. Nice, Easter time is here again. Now I bet you recognize this next song as Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer had a very shiny nose. But it's not Christmas, we can't sing that song, so I want to change the words to this. Peter the Easter Bunny, well he has a basket full of eggs. Peter the Easter Bunny, well he has the fastest bunny legs. Well Peter the Easter Bunny, well he visits little girls and boys. Peter the Easter Bunny, he brings us lots of Easter joys. Just to wake up on that Easter day, you tiptoe down the stairs. Peter with the fastest legs will have the treats left right there. Peter the Easter Bunny, well he has a basket full of eggs. Peter the Easter Bunny, well he has the fastest oh my goodness, we just changed the words. We can call that a word play because we changed all the words. Oh well, let me see if I've got any more Easter songs that I want to do. No, I think that's all the Easter songs I want to do today. I want to do this one again. We read the book, remember it was a really book, and it went like, On top of spaghetti, all covered in cheese. Remember it? I lost my poor people when somebody... Uh, uh, oh, all that grass and flowers makes me sneeze. Woo! It rolled off the table and onto the floor. And then my poor meatball, it rolled out the door. It rolled to the garden and under a bush. A bush! And then my poor meatball. It was nothing but mush. Ooh, probably got mold on. The mold was as tasty, ooh, as tasty could be. And early next summer, it grew into a tree. The tree was all covered with that beautiful moss. Well, it grew lovely meatballs and tomato sauce. So if you eat spaghetti, all covered with cheese, hold on to your meatball and don't ever cry. onto those meatballs so they don't fall under the table. But I don't know, I'd probably like a meatball treat. Meatballs are really expensive to make. Hamburger's sort of expensive meat to make, but I love spaghetti and meatballs. Put some Parmesan cheese on the top. Ooh, Parmesan cheese, though. That makes me think of that other song that we did, remember? But what cheese was it? Mozzarella. 
pizza, 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 please. Topped with mozzarella cheese. Pizza's big, pizza's small. Pizza must be good for all. Do you remember that one? Let's do it together. Here we go. Pizza, 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 please. Topped with mozzarella cheese. Pizza big, pizza small. Pizza must be good for all. Well, remember, I used three different voices. Pizza big, pizza small. And I use my cookie monster. Pizza must be good for all. Let's try it again. Here we go. Pizza, 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 please. Topped with mozzarella cheese. Pizza big. Pizza small. Pizza must be good for all. Nice. Remember the popcorn one? So we've got to remember the difference between beat and rhythm. Beats are steady, sure, and strong. Rhythms are the patterns of short and long. Remember, rhythm matches the words. Rhythms are the patterns of short and long. Beats just steady. Beats are steady, sure, and strong. So let's do beat first. My head feels the beat of the popcorn, pop, popcorn, pop, popcorn. My head feels the beat of the popcorn, pop, popcorn, pop, pop. My hand feels the beat of the popcorn, pop, popcorn, popcorn. My hands feel the beat of the popcorn, pop, popcorn, pop, pop. Let's switch to rhythm now. So rhythms match exactly with the words. My hands feel the rhythm of the popcorn. Popcorn, pop, popcorn. My hands feel the rhythm of the popcorn. Pop, popcorn, pop, pop. My nose feels the rhythm of the popcorn. Pop, popcorn, pop, popcorn. My nose feels the rhythm of the popcorn. Pop, popcorn, pop, pop. Let's take another song. We did it today. Yankee Doodle went to town, riding on his pony. If we did beat with that. Yankee Doodle went to town, riding on his pony. Let's switch to rhythm now. Yankee Doodle went to town, riding on his pony. Stuck a feather in his hat, he called it macaroni. A little bit different, isn't it? Because it matches the words. Remember, beats are steady, sure, and strong. Rhythms are the patterns of short and long. Nice. Let's just do a couple rhythms today. Not that many. I just want to do a couple. Let me get a couple out here. Let's try this one here. Mm. So I see tiki 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 tiki. Oh, not tiki tiki. Sorry. I looked at it wrong. Ti 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 ta. Feel with me here. Ti 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 ta. By yourself, please. Four, three. Here we go. Now, if you've made your shaker, maybe you still have a shaker, but after this Easter, hopefully mom and dad let you do a little bit of Easter egg in your hunt in your own yard. Maybe they'll get some plastic eggs for you, and then you can make your shaker. Remember, I have peanuts in this one that you can put rice or beans or anything. So this one would be. What about this one? I'm not going to say it this time. Let's just listen. Nice. One more. Oh, this one's a little bit tricky because it has this rest up here. Rest, T, T, rest, ta. Remember we used shh, didn't we? Shh, T, T, shh, ta. Now, I didn't play it on the shh, remember, because there's no sound. Here we go. Do it with my eight this time. Tee tee ta. Nice. Good job, guys. All right. Today, since it's such a beautiful springtime and all the sun and the flowers are coming out, usually we would be going to baseball games and we would be watching the Cardinals play, or maybe we'd even be playing Little League or um, Little League Baseball or something like that. With social distancing, we just can't do that right now. But I wore my hat today because I've been working in the yard. Plus, I wanted to do this little special song because I'm going to have to take this hat off when we do this. Today, I want to talk about the Star Spangled Banner. 
The Star Spangled Banner, or also known as our national anthem, is a special song to all Americans that celebrates us being Americans. Now, it started out as, as a poem a long, long time ago by a, name, a man named Francis Scott Key. He was actually a prisoner on a ship, and he was watching this huge battle happen, and he was really scared because he was scared that he might not make it through the battle. But every time he heard a big explosion, he would look out and he would see if the flag on the fort was still waving. And when he saw that flag still waving, he knew everything was going to be all right. And that next mer morning, early in the morning, after all the gunfire and the cannons had stopped, he looked and that flag was still there. So he knew everything was going to be okay. So this is our Star Spangled Banner. Now it used to be a poem, but now we have a song that we sing at a lot of sporting events, baseball games, a lot of times. Now, there's a couple of things that we're supposed to do when we have this national anthem. We're supposed to first take our hat off. Here's a little bit messed up, but that's okay because everybody's going to take their hat off with this national anthem. Also, we're supposed to stand up out of our chairs when we perform this national anthem. And we're supposed to place our hand over our heart. So if you're talking, we're not really wanting to talk too much during this. We wanted to just be silent and listen to the song, or you can sing along. And if you're talking on the cell phone, that's not what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to stand quietly and respectfully while this song is singing. If you want to sing along, you can. Your hand over your heart, nice and quiet, just sort of like when you do the Pledge of Allegiance in the morning. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. That's what we do in the morning, but we're going to sing this song today instead. I have this little book for you so you can see the words too. Now I'm going to sing it just nice and softly, but you guys at home, if you want to stand, put your hand over your heart, that would be good. Here we go. Oh, say can you see? By the dawn's early light, what so proudly we hail at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight. That's the battle I was talking about. For the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming. And the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air. That our flag was still there. Oh, see, does that star spangled banner yet wave for the land of the free and the After the song's over, a lot of people, when the game's over, they say, play ball. Or when the song's over, they yell, play ball. And we can have our seat and we can put our hats back on. But that song is called our national anthem or the Star Spangled Banner. So remember, when you hear that song, a lot of people, they'll say, please rise for our national anthem. Everybody stand up. Everybody take their hat off. If they got one, they'll put their hand over their heart, too. Now, when I talk about the Star Spangled Banner, I also like to talk about this other special song, too. This other special song is called Lift Every Voice and Sing. Now, some other people might say that this is their national anthem, too. So I don't have time today to go through all of it, but next time I'll play this with somebody sing who sings it better than I do. But I wanted to show it to you. I'll sing just the first couple verses of it. Maybe you've even heard it before. And it goes like this. Lift every voice and sing Till earth and heaven ring 
Ring with the harmonies of liberty. Have you heard that one before? Yeah. I'll lift every voice and sing. I'll make sure to do this one on Monday because I don't want to take up a lot of your time today, guys. I know that you're having a good Easter um, Friday and Monday and it's on your break. And even mommy, mom and dad might even be home with you today. So you have time to go out and enjoy the day. So I want to leave you with this one today. Let's do this. Can you stand, please? We're going to shake it. Here we go. We're going to shake it. Posted up this little song, and it was a sing along. So if you guys watch this little sing along, you guys can sing this with me too. If I can find my capo, see where I laid it down at. Oh, here it is. Did you guys watch that Rainbow Connection last time? I posted it up there, and you could sing along with Kermit the Frog. Let's just do this little first part of it. Kermit sings it better than me. I like Kermit singing it. Why are there so many songs about rainbows? What's on the other side? Rainbows are visions, but only illusions. Rainbows have nothing to What's so amazing, it keeps us stargazing. What do you think we might see? Someday we'll find it, the rainbow connection, the lovers, the dreamers, and me. Have you been half asleep? Them calling my name. We'll leave it right there. If you want to do that last part with me, let's do this little last part. Someday we'll find it, the rainbow connection, the lovers, the dreamers, and me. Happy Easter all to all of you. See if you can catch Peter Rabbit. He's fast. I don't know if you can can't catch Peter Rabbit, you can always pick up some of those eggs. You guys have a great rest of your day. See you on Monday.